question is from John and he asks, how do I regain trust when it has been destroyed? Don't you have to trust? Don't you have to have trust as the foundations of your marriage? Uh, he does, I mean, he doesn't say what, what the, what's going on there, but it's all about trust. You absolutely want to get back to a place of trust. But, um, you know, I, I always joke that the reason we say I do is not for the times that we're madly in love, but for those times when we just want to, you know, end it all, toss our partner out a window. So um, <clears throat> it, you can have periods where, you're, where, you're, where there's trust not there, and you want to work very hard to get back to that place. So, yes, trust is vital in a relationship. It's very important, but um, it can be re-earned. And I say earned on purpose. Trust is earned, right? So um, over time, as the partner who has broken the trust um, continues to show that they are trustworthy, that they are honest, that they are uh, uh, giving forth all information, that they're not withholding, hiding, keeping secrets, and so on and so forth, trust can be earned back. And again, the reason we say I do is to be able to withstand that time, right? To say, okay, yeah. well, I promised I'd stick around as that trust is rebuilt. So yes, trust is vital to a relationship, but it can take some time to build again. And then after a while, at some point, trust is a choice, interestingly enough, um, uh, from the person who is giving the trust. So right. I, after yeah, the person has... about that, I has, think, in our Affair Proof solution. Absolutely, right? yeah. After people have shown that they're trustworthy, it's a decision. It's a decision to risk your heart again. It's a decision to risk your pride again. It's a decision to say, well, I'm, I'm going to decide to trust you from here on out because you've shown me that you are trustworthy and, um, you know, and I'm going to, again, forgive the past, recognize that it's in the past, understand that people grow, people change, people learn, um, and I'm going to decide to trust you. And at that point, from that point forward, you want to live in a relationship that is, is completely uh, given of, with trust and there's no suspicion and there's no questions mm -hmm. in it because that will eventually erode and end the relationship. Right. You, your relationship cannot sustain itself for a very long period of time with no trust. So hopefully the party who lost the trust in the first place will earn it back. John will decide to give that trust at some point and the marriage will be back on track. Mm -hmm. Wonderful. Well, thank you so much for sharing that. I really appreciate sure. it. If you'd like your question answered, please ask it in the comment box below because this is a regular series and we wanna help as many people as we can. And if you'd like even more powerful free relationship advice from Dr. Dana, click on the link below the video. Thanks so much for watching. Talk to you soon.